it as a watercolor. Let me go ahead into the next one, which is the little baby face. And I'm gonna go into filter again. I'm gonna go down to where it says render. And there's a thing called lens flare, which I forget about sometimes. But it does give you some of those really cool flares. You have the 50 to 300 millimeter, I guess, zoom. You also have the 35. And you can see in this little preview area what it's gonna do. You can move this effect wherever you want to. You just click on it and drag it to the area. And you can kind of see what the differences are with each of these. I'm just gonna keep it with this one, maybe move it down here a little bit. Before you click on OK, you can also change the brightness by taking this slider and moving it from side to side. Once you're done and you have the effect you like, click on OK, and now you have that lens flare. I really like that. It gives a little bit of a glam to maybe senior pictures, not necessarily baby photos, but I thought it was a good photo to try it out on. Hi everyone, I just wanted to personally thank you for allowing me to be part of your Diddy Scrap journey. I also have a quick question for you. What are some of the things that stop you uh, from learning Photoshop elements? Or maybe I should put it this way. What do you find you struggle with most when you're working in Photoshop elements or trying to do digital scrapbooking? Please post in the comments below and I will try to get to them and also maybe I will make a quick video about your subject that you are struggling most with. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day. Bye for now.